there, I'm Critzy Bear. Welcome back to Cataclysm. Do you remember last episode where I said I was feeling a little bit under the weather, so I was going to be a little chill? Well, that was a week ago. That episode was meant to go up last week, and I just, I ended up feeling so much worse that I just, <clears throat> I gave up on uh, maintaining my YouTube for a little while. Uh, but hello, I'm back. <clears throat> I'm still feeling a little sick. You know, my throat hurts if I talk too excitedly, so I should probably chill out. Last time, we were getting ready for a big hunting session. We got a lot of stuff ahead of us. So first of all, should probably dig a fire ring, <coughs> right? You know, because I'm going to be out here like at least two days, and I'm definitely going to get hungry and thirsty, and I'm going to need someplace to cook food and stuff. So I think that might be one of the first thing I do is uh, dig the fire ring, <coughs> right? You know, someplace to cook food. And I think after that, we're ready to go hunting. Yeah. Oh, I mean, I already got water. Just food. Well, half of the stuff I'm going to be hunting are triffids. I can eat that raw. And I can make the organs and stuff into blood essence. <clears throat> or not the organs, but the meat, rather. You know, because, uh, guys, wasn't there another reason I wanted to come out, out, out here? Marlos, not meat. Yeah, if I end up killing anything made of meat, I'll just make it into blood essence. I'll eat raw triffids, and I'm sure I'll be fine. All right, so I suppose there's no reason not to get right into it. <coughs> Did I take any snacks with me? I took my Marlot swine. I'll go ahead and take some. Oh, shoot. Uh, what happened? What, what just happened? You drink your Marlot swine. Wait, there we go, I see the unusual me message. As you eat the Marlowe swine, you have a near-religious experience, feeling at one with your surroundings. Well, that's because I have exhumed spores. Elated, enhanced blocking, from what? Oh, from brawling. <clears throat> Alright. So I'm just elated? Any generally good stats? Alright. How's my morale looking? Absolutely phenomenal. I should have read my holy books before drinking that. Now I know. Um, also, you know, I came out here for berries anyway, so... Shucks, I wish I learned that spell. That was what... I did learn that spell! Right? Clarity of Blood! Grant protection against parasites. Alright, there we go. <coughs> You are many, but I am more than all of you. Inspirational. Let me go ahead and draw my lich hook now, and we're going to take care of these. Oh, these are friendly mushrooms. Interesting. All right. Well, no fungal infection, but we do have some Marlos. I'm not sure we'll be able to get it in uh, uh, home in time, though. <clears throat> Six Marlos berries. Yeah, I don't think those are going to last. I'd need more yeast immediately. I could probably get, like, a year's supply of Marlowe swine if I find, like, the proper Triffid Grove. You know, I can just buff myself, you know, resist uh, re resist the spores. I could be just in and out. It could be, like, the last thing I do is, is I, real quick, just take a little dip in. Anyway, <clears throat> what's my focus looking like? 88. Sheesh. Should be trending towards 189. My goodness. Is it going to have an issue where it, it's going to make me demutate? Looks like the core of the Triffid territory. No, that's a wasp pipe over there. All right. So the core of the Triffid territory could be anywhere. <clears throat> Where's the other end? Didn't I encounter Triffids up here too? Oh, that was way up there, right? I don't know. I'm going to go northwest and see how I fare. I've buffed my agility. I'm very happy. Wish my focus was a little higher. Oh, you know what? I don't want to be over here at all. Um, you know what? I'm going to kill the fungaloid. You know, since I got my my defense thing up, I'm going to go ahead and kill the, the shambler here. Shamblers. Get out of here. Be gone. Fungicide in human form. Indeed. Alright. Now light a 
fire over here. Gonna come get this one too. I'm gonna kill anything that comes out of the woods. Start fire. One here too. And who else wants to wants to fight? Uh, fungaloid shambler. One to the southwest. Fungaloid sham. Both to the southwest. I don't like the sporlings though. I don't know. <clears throat> Maybe I should just settle for things that actually come out of the woods. <coughs> I'm gonna go ahead and store that away and switch to Sojutsu. Oh, I wasn't even using a martial art. Because we got a great mantis here. Hello, great beast of the forest. I am honored to be your foe. Sorry, I was just checking my settings real quick. I kind of just jumped into this video as soon as I had Cataclysm open. Anyway. Jeez, I do a lot of damage with this spear. Man. All right, well, Mantis has been quelled. I mean, I guess I could take it home, get some sinew out of it. <clears throat> so, first kill of the game. You know, the game I'm playing by being out in the woods hunting things. Um, I'm a... That's not... That's not how hunters use that term. I don't think... I, I don't think I, I use that correctly. <laughs> <coughs> Speaking of game... You know, there's been a game I, I've loved since I was a kid. Um, well, I guess I haven't loved it since I was a kid. I haven't played it since I was a kid, and I used to love it since I was a kid. So, I, I technically, I don't still love it. But it used to be a thing I liked. Um, <clears throat> Hello? Oh, I couldn't go diagonally. Maybe I got it? Lead corpse. Field dress corpse. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to field dress it real quick. Zombie dog? I mean, I could probably counterattack. Look at how far the blood went. No, oh, I should have been more careful. You know what? My pentaceratops can handle a zombie dog, I think. Anyway, <clears throat> there's been this game... <laughs> I haven't been able to find it since I was a kid. I've asked I, I've asked a lot of my friends, and none of them have ever been able to find it for me. You know, I've asked people who are, are good at finding old, obscure things like this, but um, I used to play this game on, like, my, my grandfather's computer. Well, I guess grandfather. It's a kind of a complicated family uh, situation. Um... <clears throat> But, but he was like the family grandfather character, even though, yeah. Anyway, there's one. Got a Triffid. Triffid flower over there. Um, It was this... Ah, three of them. It was this uh, hunting game, right? But you were hunting dinosaurs, okay? Oh, wrong martial art. Thanks for reminding me by hitting me. Um, But it wasn't Turok. <clears throat> You would get, like, airdropped into a certain dinosaur era, right? And it wasn't all dinosaurs at once, you know? You weren't seeing, like, T-Rexes hanging out with, uh, you know, whatever. Another stereotypical dinosaur that people mistake for being from the same era, you know? You would get dropped into a certain era, and there would only be the given dinosaurs of that era to hunt, right? Another one coming. I'm going to martial art this guy. And <clears throat> you would have various uh, kind of like optional assistant things. Um, like you could uh, camouflage your scent or you could camouflage your, your visibility. Um, but certain... Dinosaurs like uh, Velociraptors, I think, could still hear you. I remember so much about this. Um, when you killed something, you had to call it in, and a helicopter or something would come and, and pick it up. Helicopter or a spaceship or something like that. <clears throat> and they would tell you what kind of dinosaur it was and give you points for it. And you could go in like, hunting a specific kind of dinosaur. And I remember I, I was playing it when I was like six or so, so it had to be a, a 90s game. I 
Oh, fire! Nice! I, I, I was wondering what was going on on the mini-map there. I was like, what? What is that spreading brown stuff? That's dirt from the fire. <clears throat> Glad I came over here. Glad I took care of those tr those funguses first, too. <clears throat> Sorry, what was that? Big painful message? Oh, too late to look at it now. <laughs> no, stop. And, like, people have suggested games to me that it could be, but it has never been correct. Like, I've brought it up on my YouTube channel before, and it's never... Like, this This is a, a premise that's been done by multiple games, <clears throat> and it's never the right one. Sorry, I was just thinking about it, thinking if I could think of any other, like, identifying information to make it easier to actually functionally find that. What time is it? Well, it's afternoon. <clears throat> I have a lot of bodies to take care of. Uh, should I do the mantis? Uh, you know, I just want the sinew out of that guy, so I don't really need to worry about it rotting. Honestly, I didn't even need to field dress it, now that I think about it. That's not cannabis, is it? Dang. I think I saw the wild cannabis, like, all the way, all the way over here or something, along this path, north of here? Because I was looking for Spurge, right? And I was checking flowers, and I was like, well, I didn't know cannabis grew in all these. I wish they had, like, different sprites. <clears throat> but, uh, to be fair, this is an incomplete pack as it is. Like, we're about to walk up on a pentaceratops with no sprite. <coughs> Sorry, I keep coughing. Like I said, I'm still feeling under the weather. Will these all fit in here? They will. Alright. Time to take a drink. Clean water. Examine vehicle. Siphon that into my water skin. Ooh, we gotta get real, gotta get real tedious with it, eh? <clears throat> Alright, well, you know, let's do it one at a time. Yeah. Full butchery. It's early evening. We're gonna have to sleep soon. Full butchery. It's warm out. I don't know how long these are gonna last. <clears throat> no, it looks like I can take care of them all today. Let's see how many vegetables this gives us. And we'll see if I want to go back for more. Like, I'm looking for, like, at least, like, a thousand vegetables. So that I can eat them whenever. Fiber stalks, plant marrow. All right. It's like one more day of hunting. Sure. Um. From the ground. From the ground. Nope. Need to instead get the, not the fiber stalks. Instead the, yep. Marrow. <clears throat> I would love to also take the. Um. Fibrous stalks with me. But, I don't want to do that until I have, like, at least, like, a hundred... <coughs> you know, a hundred berries. Well, actually, don't I only have 20 yeast? So I need 20 berries, then. Alright. 20 Marlos berries. A thousand vegetables. If I have room after that... Um... Yeah. I'll... Also take home some stalks. To scutch... Take all that off of here. I don't know. Should I also get the mantis while I'm at it? Oh, I already took the sinews out? Inventory? Hmm. Spend an hour butchering this guy, and then it's bedtime. Well, then it's magic time. Then it's bedtime. <clears throat> Please. Please. Oh, because I'm weary. It's gonna be frickin' daytime by the time I finish! Whoa! No! Uh. Oh, this exhaustion is a little silly. It's a little silly. A little goofy. I'll admit. 
But okay. <laughs> Alright. Sorry, I haven't put the plant marrow into my my friend's... Oh, shit! I ate the escape stone! Where am I? You have no idea where you are. Hello? C can I leave? Interesting. Oh, I'm real glad I have that now. Hang on. What happens if I cast overgrowth in here? Hello? Oh, hang on. Dang. I was hoping it would convert terrain. <clears throat> Warped wall? I don't have a pickaxe with me, do I? Dang. Alright, well, I can sleep on some grass, I guess. Oh, hey, I'm back home. <laughs> Oops. Hey, quack grass. Uh, you doing okay? Full health. All right. I gotta collect more of those. That was so useful. Like, imagine I pop in there. In an emergency, take some time to patch myself up, you know, drink a red potion, drink a black potion, maybe. See if I can write out its effects. Um, <clears throat> pop a healing spell. Rebuff myself. Alright, I mean, I wish portal storms would happen more often so I could more reliably collect those. I suppose I'll just have to value them highly, because that was actually genuinely useful. I'm glad I know what it does now. <clears throat> Alright, well. Uh, no, I think I'm fine. Let me drink a little more Merlot sweat. I'm gonna wait for tomorrow. Right, I gotta figure out why these are not in the dinosaurs. Plant marrow's too heavy? It's 200 pounds. Oh, because you're attached to all the water, too. Ah. All right. Fudge. All right, well. <clears throat> can you carry the butchery rack? Yes, we confirmed that before. And I can carry the shelter kit. All right, so if I give you the butchering rack... Will the plant marrow... Oop, meant to pick it up. Oops. Oh, he would only have been able to fit, like, 400 of it anyway. Yeah, no, that's not going to fit at all. <coughs> I suppose I could carry the plant marrow. Uh, carry the plant marrow. Put the... Please, please... Where's, where's the other plant marrow? Is it in my inventory? Is it on the ground? Where, where is it? Where's the other plant marrow? I should... There should be several hundred of it. Where did it go? Everything inventory... Where's... Okay. Ah, oh, I see. <clears throat> I, I accidentally put it on the ground. All right. Phew! I was so confused. All right. There we go. Got the plant marrow back. So I can't fit it in the basket. I can't fit it in the dinosaur. But I can probably carry it. It's going to be 200 pounds or 300 by the time I'm done. Speaking of which, I hope that they'll stack. They probably won't, given I'm going to be sleeping here. <clears throat> well, you know what? If I have to, I'll kill four, five Triffids tomorrow. S screw it. Um, I'll kill, like, two, and see if the... See if the parts stack. Okay. Oop. Siphon that into that you know I could probably keep the hose in the wagon too since it's, I'm only ever going to use it here there it is put the leather hose in there don't need it um 
You know what? I'll eat some of the plant marrow for Brecky, too. Mmm. <coughs> now I should take home as much as I can. Wait, is it? It's about to be bedtime again. I'm gonna go into... Ah, there's the grove. Lovely. I don't think there's any reason for me to go all the way in there, is there? I don't think so. All right, drawing my lich hook. Got the right martial arts up. I do. Let me go ahead and drink my Merlos wine. I think. You know what? You know what? Let me gather some focus first. Yeah, screw it. All right. S D F G H J. Drink the Marlos wine. And. Uh, maybe pray for a minute? Meditate for a moment. <clears throat> Alright. Now my focus is 137 and trending towards 190. Dang, alright. We're gonna get some martial arts done. What gives me the most dodges? I think Kung Fu, actually, right? Dragon's Knowledge. <clears throat> Minus 25% of Dexterity. Dragon Power. Dragon Wing. I'm looking for dodges. Claw, tail, strike. No, offensive, offensive, offensive. I'm looking for defensive. Arm blocks. No, I don't think that's the best one. Um, Shrike's talons, I actually think, does include do extra dodges, right? Hang on. So let me wait for a minute. <clears throat> I should have, like... Shouldn't I have a boost from standing still? Huh. Oh, whatever. I think I should have dodges anyway. I wanna... Ah! Hello, you! You here to duel me? Ow. I've killed it already. <coughs> oh, that's uh, that's toxic smoke. Oh, get away from that. Don't wanna fight that guy. Dragging the Triffid along. I'm gonna kinda let me around the peripheral here because I don't want to get too deep. I don't want to see vine monsters and fungal fighters and oh, just regular old triffids. That's what I want to see. Something else coming along. Oh, just a regular old triffid. Get my fight experience in. Still rusty. In every field. I do not fight enough. Oh. Hello, Triffid. Goodbye, Triffid. Vine Beast. I think I'll take out my spear for that one. Uh, looking for a Sojutsu. Yep. And there you go. <clears throat> Another vine beast coming. Yeah, does that one have a different? No, it doesn't. I, I was just looking at it through stuff. Get okay, him! All right, got him. Too many triffids. Essence though. Nice. <clears throat> All right, I'm going back. Put my spear away. Oh, good. Another one. You know what? I'll get my Kung Fu experience in, too. Sure. Dragon Kung Fu. I don't have my agility enhanced right now. Yeah, I see. I see the Triffid. Yep, there it is. Be gone, Triffid. Behold my martial prowess. Some people say I'm an alien. You know why? Because my moves are out of this world. That's right. That's how confident I am. I'll make jokes as we're engaging combat. I am a unique character. I am I am different because I don't take myself seriously. Oh shit, I'm bleeding. Aren't I? Oh, I should take a second to stop. There we go. Nope, oh, got a vine beast coming. Let's go ahead and draw my, my sphere. 
I'm sure if it's gonna take all day to take apart. <clears throat> Ow. How far are we from the forest's edge? Very close, in fact. That's a spurge. That's a spurge. Go figure, I'm finding spurge everywhere. Now that uh, I'm not saving somebody's life. Is that a spurge? Yep, that's spurge. Do I need to field dress these guys? No, I don't think so. I mean, they're all plan, right? <clears throat> Just checking my mutations, like checking that the uh, Marlos has not addled my dragon mutations. I'm going to go ahead and enhance my speed a couple of times here. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that's way better. <laughs> cool. Also, yoink. Oh, that's so much better. Sorry, what's my strength and stuff down for? Oh, because I'm poisoned and in pain. <clears throat> oh, you know, I could fix at least one of those things. Go ahead and use my healing spell on me. Yeah, there we go. Now we're moving. <coughs> it's gonna be daytime by the time we're done. It's midnight right now. It's gonna be morning soon. Oh no! Cease! You left your bodies behind. Yeah, go through the spider zone here. Get them back. Where are they? Where'd they go? There they are. Sheesh. Also finding new spider dens. <laughs> I hate this area. I'm glad there's no uh, <coughs> no spiders occupying them. I don't know why. Like you would think they're here for a reason, but n no. Oh, you know, one thing I should do is uh, I should fill my sealed stomach with black potion as well, because like pain is the main reason that I ever stop adventures. I don't know, what adventures am I planning on going on after this? I, I've already explored. There's still the ruin I haven't opened yet. I've never been inside of one of those places. Okay. Got some triffids here. Hey, Penta friend. I had a successful day hunting. Make sure to stay hydrated. <sighs> I gotta get the hose manually. Siphon from the barrel. Thanks. You know, the barrel was a good idea and all. But I think once we get home, I'm gonna make like a, a pot to go beside it. There's a the hose. There it is. Put the hose back down. <clears throat> Should I take a nap first? I mean, it is dark, but, like, uh, yeah, you know, because I do have to head into dangerous territory anyway. I don't want to completely exhaust myself um, prior to the uh, adventure's conclusion. I mean, I'm probably going to be, like, exhausted as far as weariness goes. <clears throat> Eat a bunch of healthy greens today. Good morning. Quack grass, look at that, I remembered your name and everything. All of them? Two hours, that's it? All right. Shoot. Oh, and I'm sweating, too. Sheesh. Oh, to fix that. There we go. Where is the water? Drink my entire water skin. Can't those things hold, like, a gallon? Shouldn't that be sick now? Um, move the marrow. Oh, good, they don't stack. Oh, good. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, we'll see how much I can fit in my inventory. Cool. I mean, yeah, it's about as much as I needed, anyway. Alright, I'll carry the other 800. Cool. Okay, so let's put these side over here. Really wanted to take some of the stalks as well. And don't look like that's gonna be possible. It's probably too heavy for the dinosaur, right? 
How heavy is this? It's 300 pounds. Ain't no way our dinosaur's carrying any of that. <clears throat> I want it, though. Much as I want it, I can't have it. Can't always get what you want. Okay. Now, uh, we are hydrated. We are not terribly weary. What's, uh, what's up with our effects? Just hot. I think hot and thirsty. Should be recovering in a moment. Uh, enhance my agility. Boop, boop, boop. When we get a little closer, I'm doing the other buff. But for now, um, just pay attention. Remember to stop once we get close enough to fungus. <coughs> you are an issue. I'm gonna go ahead and draw my hook. How did you get here, buddy? Go ahead and, uh, real quick, make sure I apply clarity of blood. How long is that gonna work? 10 minutes? Let's go ahead and up that to 20 minimum. Just so I don't, like, forget in the middle of combat. Oh, make sure I'm using... You know what? I'm gonna use my spear for this one. It just seems appropriate, you know, for the task at hand. You know, wiping out fungal colonies and such. Alright, start a fire. There you go. Who's next? Oh, we got one up here. Hey, you. You're gonna have to stop doing that. It's against the law, you see. Hey, you. Start another fire. <clears throat> and another fungaloid. Oh, you know, I did leave a bunch of sporlings intact. That might be where they came from. <coughs> another fire. I think I got this candle with me. And you! Where'd it go? Oh, it's up here now. Oh, that's a cat, isn't it? Oh, never mind. You, though. Be gone. Oh, it's already burning over there, so burn over here. Alright. Anyone else? Want to become past tense? You! Thanks for volunteering! Start a fire. You'd think the fungal colony would be having a reaction by now. Well, I don't know, maybe they're used to being eaten by ants and stuff, so they don't really panic if, if one of them dies. But you'd think after this many, they would have a reaction eventually, right? I'm gonna drink some of my Marlos wine while we're engaging in, in destroying a Marlos colony. Harvest that. Get the berries. Harvest that. Get the berries. Yep, thanks. Oh, also fire. Oh, I already got a fire here. <laughs> nice. <clears throat> so remember to consume the Marlos wine outside of the camp. <clears throat> Good to know. I mean, I'm lucky that didn't happen someplace more important, right? Oh, we're getting closer. Fungus is getting thick. <laughs> Look, that one just grew up right in front of me. Hey, you. Surprising lack of blight around here, though. Oop. Walk through a gaggle of weeds. Hey, you wouldn't have happened to have uh, seen any any wild um, hemp around here, would you? I'm looking to make a hemp-based product. Oh, this Tatura. Not the kind of high I'm looking for. Too intense. I can't get anything done when I'm on it. No, I tried it once, experimented with it for a bit. Oh, here's the bloom. <clears throat> I mean, this is just like a temporary thing, but it's like a good... A good precaution for uh, the adventure I'm engaging in. Sheesh. Fungal mass. Thick ropes of mycel matter have covered the ground here completely. Soft to the touch, but not firm enough to hold any weight. What do you mean, but firm enough, but not firm enough? Soft to the touch, but not firm enough to hold any weight. That, those don't, those don't contradict each other. Those are, are fine. That's normal. Like, if it's soft to the touch, it would not be... Firm enough to hold any weight. You would you would say like it is soft to the touch, comma, not firm enough to hold any weight, or soft to the touch and 
I would accept that too. Um, <clears throat> I, I'm taking um, you know a, a small deduction from your from your uh, from your final score. It will be reflected in the end of the year. So it turns out uh, this is not the correct form of fungus. There, there is no more loss here. <clears throat> Where do Marloss berries come from? Oh, hello. Spores, spores. Yeah. I mean, if you're not going to give me what I want, I mean, I, I guess I'll just, I'll just leave you alone, you know? I mean, I got seven berries. That's not a lot. And they were all from me drinking the wine. Maybe I can farm the berries from drinking the wine. I mean, I got my... You got my plants, right? I, I got the plants I was after. <clears throat> Man, this is a durable fungaloid. All right, you. There you go. Thanks, buddy. Oh, another one to burn. I don't know. Is there any other fungal bloom? Fungal tower? Fungal flowers? Is fungal flowers the one I'm thinking of? Uh, am I at the opposite side of the valley here? I mean, I see no reason <clears throat> why I have to move everything. I can just, like, maybe grab them on my way home? <clears throat> Let's see, I'm gonna have to take the wagon southeast anyway. Oh, wait, never mind! Well, I was reluctant because I'd need to move it past the Migos, but... Come to think of it, it's it's like just about as far away from the other one as it is to this one. So I, I don't see why I can't just step over there, not even make a big deal out of it. Because, like, honestly, I would be impeding myself if I took the wagon over there, because, like, I would need to take it around the Mego Tower anyway, so I would have to double back. Unless there's someplace else I want to go. Wasn't I considering looking around for NPCs? Seeing if they have any, uh... <laughs> wool, was it? Or cotton? Got hiccups now. Yarn, specifically. <clears throat> wow, surprised the fire's not still going over here. Alright, well, I suppose I'm done. Um, <clears throat> you know, I'm gonna scout through this area to the southwest, too. Oh, fungal tower down there. Uh, suppose. I mean, am I still protected? Yeah, I am for 13 more minutes. I'm gonna go ahead and let these guys rest now. You know, my invasion is done. I'm just gonna leave. <clears throat> I'm walking near a big ol' impact crater. Nice. Cool. Love impacts. Love making an impact. Love being around impactful things. Tricera truck. I mean, that probably has an impact. Uh, so, technically, I should love it, but I'm not necessarily loving this. Um, theropod Juggernaut, Tricera Truck, alright, um, you guys enjoy fighting the fungus. Why are you after me? No, go after the, go after the, the tower. Well, whatever. Can you, can you fight the tower? Who, who wins in this fight? <clears throat> can you do reach attacks? I, it probably can. Like, there is very likely that I'm going to come through here again. I might as well deal with the threat while it's here. You there! I approach the scene, and I slam the butt of my spear upon the ground. You shall cease immediately! That did, I don't know, one hit point of elemental damage to the skeletal juggernaut. Now I'm going to fall back behind my minions. <coughs> Go! Attack, centipedes! I cast, uh... I, I, I cast summon attack centipede. Now, I'm going to... Still got sojutsu. Fall back to over here. Maybe enhance my agility. A couple times. Okay. <sighs> Are you big enough? Are you big? Are you big enough to hit me over here? What's the what's the Joker not doing? Ah, it is. 
It can do reaching attacks, and it will probably fling me. <clears throat> Problem. Solution? Add more centipedes. Well, the proposed solution does appear to be working. However, I'm not sure if it's going to work at a fast enough rate. Also, why is the skeleton not attacking my centipedes? <laughs> Look at him go. Look at him go! <coughs> he was just trying to wade through a crowd of centipedes, trying to attack the fungaloid. You know what, I'm going to go ahead and consider that situation attended to. Now, where's the uh, other one? Where's the Triceratops? Fungal Triceratops zombie. Fascinating! There's fungal varieties of dinosaur zombies. Once a massive four-legged dino uh, dinosaur herbivore with a bony crest, fungal tendrils now sprout from its mouth, eyes, and other orifices. Holding together a shambling mass of mold-covered, advanced description. <clears throat> Are there any Marlos bushes over here? Bushes. No. Shambling mass of mold-covered flesh. Yeah, it's just a mold man. Mold monster. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. Nah, you know, I should deal with it. Fungal Z-Rex? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. You're killing me. You're killing me. Can fungal towers just, like, convert zombies? Because, I mean, that would be an interesting feature. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and tr go around. Sorry, is this a... Oh, it's a fungal zombie. <clears throat> I see. Well, I'm going to go ahead and go around. And actually, I'm going to go ahead and start a fire. Okay. Now, the idea is, you know what zombies love? <clears throat> Noisy, bright things. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. I just ran into another one. No, never mind. It's all the way over there. thing I'm running into is a death rattle. And it is actually coming after me, so i got to be careful here. Little careful, because these guys can bite me in half. Make sure to position carefully. Be patient, and nothing bad will ever happen. It's coming after me. It's coming after me. All right. <clears throat> well, let's see. Can it do a ranged attack? Can it outreach me even with the spear? It is. It, it can. Oh, but I can damage it with my spear. However, it is stubborn about it, so I think I'm going to take out my armor-piercing lich hook. I'm going to risk. I'm, I'm going to take an incredible risk. Also, I think I might take off my satchel. Yeah, just for now. <clears throat> Maybe my, my spear, too? Let's see if ta if I prepare in advance, am I good enough to kill a single dinosaur in single combat? 28 damage so far, not stunned. Uh, my head is bleeding severely. Alright. I'm cutting my throat. Sheesh. I I've got a torn jugular right now. Yeah, I don't know, man. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and do sorcery. Back off. I want to place a rune, but I don't think I'm gonna have time. Just spend a couple turns holding ho holding pressure to the wound, draw the lich. Might have to use my vulnerary. <clears throat> so it turns out, no. Dinosaur is a bit more dangerous than I anticipated. Uh, go figure. <clears throat> you know, I think I might just have to pull it into the earth with my vine magic. Because I need to kill it in a hurry. And this is like the best way. I mean, it's using a lot of blood essence. But uh, to be fair, my jugular is currently hanging open. My carotid artery has been severed by a dinosaur, and I think I I think a hurry is kind of warranted in that situation. I have no attack magic, uh, except my my magical lich hook, and this, ladies and gentlemen, is why I'm collecting essence. 
Holy cow. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. No, I, I continued bleeding. <clears throat> Get to my stuff. Where's my carmine? Got it. Apply it to my head. And there you go. Stops bleeding. Just hold my hand on my torso wound. Alright, so that's probably gonna end up costing me a bit of health. <laughs> you know, uh, finishing a fight while my, my jugular hangs open. I've said that multiple times. That's a gross image. I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm leaving. Okay. My gear all good? Yes. My health is relatively okay. Oh man, that was not fun. I'm leaving. Oh, I didn't even check that plant back there. Yo, is that yellow plant? Dandelion. Dandelion. I think it might, might have been like one of these, right? Or was it a white one? What does wild cannabis look like? Like the flowering form, I mean. White? <clears throat> Has white flowers? Okay. So, I'll look at various white things. Although, I swear I, I found it while I was looking for a yellow flower. <clears throat> Missile spider? I think I'm relatively safe to just walk straight over here. No, ignore the spider. Ignore the spider. Okay. Safe mode is on. And it has been broken by a chihuahua chasing an Albertonicus. Uh, well, I mean, I guess it's small. But I don't think it's that small. I don't think it... it I mean, is it? small enough that a chihuahua would would be considering it prey oh blue jays interesting I i've never seen well no i've seen them like at the beginning of the of this but like yeah, it's been a while you know more summon centipedes neat wood cash yeah i don't need more wood things <clears throat> hulking horror i mean i can deal with that take out my spear Sorry, did I? Okay, good. I was attacking it with Shrike's Talons. <coughs> and a bone plate? I can do that. You're a bit faster than me, though. Is my agility still on? It is, so I'm... Um... I regret choosing to engage. Oop! <laughs> Excuse me. Oh, fuck. Yeah, get him. Get him, gang. Sheesh. Alright, bye. Oh, look, they actually did it. Nice. Oh, and the bone plate is, of course, coming straight after me. That one's slower than me, though, so I don't mind as much. Get him. Oop, too close. Get him. I feel woozy? I feel woozy? What do I feel woozy for? What? Oh, it's blood loss, right? Yeah, it's probably from, from the blood loss. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> okay, continuing. Um, need some fungal flowers, please. Go on over here. And make sure to apply my clarity of blood a couple times. Protect me from the dangers I'm about to face. Do you have Marlos here? Oh, it's another skeletal-beaked juggernaut. Man... What the fuck, dude? Is there even Marlos over here? Can I even... Can I even get what I want? Yo, where's some Marlos grow? I've looked at all of them. Oh, yep, there is Marlos in there. Nice. <clears throat> Marlos flowers. Alright. I mean, there's some mild danger here. But I'm thinking... Summon some centipedes? Yeah, summon some centipedes. Deal with it. Yeah, summon some centipedes over there. Oops. Some image be down here. Y'all gonna go? Yep, you're all going after the dinosaur. All right. Nope. Oh, step into the hazy cloud. Am I doing okay? Yep, I'm doing okay. Poof. Am I doing okay? Yeah, I'm doing okay. Seventeen more minutes. Of clarity of blood should be plenty of time to slip in here. 
Take the flowers. Immense fungal blossom towering over its surroundings. Neat. I guess that's what the fungal blossoms look like. I mean, it looks reasonable. Sorry, is there a single Marlos bush here? Is this all of your Marlos? I thought I would be able to find a, a source of Marlos, like a... Ooh! Marlos tree! Nice! Uh, excuse me, I just want some of, some of this, please. Just one. Uh, yep. Just give me some of the Marlos, please. Thank you. <coughs> oh fuck! Some of the centipedes. <gasps> this is the opposite direction. Shit! Run a little bit. Much slower than me. How about if I walk? Is it still? Yeah, it's still slower than me. Phew! Well, it can also s s slam through terrain. I did manage to get a couple berries, though. Um, I have 14. I mean, that's almost my goal. So, I'm gonna see what happens if I try to loot the tree, too. Gonna make a couple centipedes out here. <clears throat> Where's the, uh, where'd the dinosaur go? There it is. Oh, that's not even the same one. I was afraid it killed my other centipedes. I didn't even have to summon one. Alright. Oh! Oh, I've already set fire to this place. Oh, what's that? Oh, it's... Oh, I could loot, um, fungal zombies. Oh, that might be a, a source of non in woods material. It is, um, looting the, the fungal zombies. <coughs> I never thought of that before. What about... What about beehives? Do they still have scarred zombies even in the woods? Hello, you. Go ahead and harvest the Marlos tree. How much does that give me? Just two berries? Wow. Disappointing, but I suppose understandable. What's that over there? It's a cardboard box of snacks. Any any more berries? Boy, I wish, but I don't think so. Ah! There's one over there. Lovely. Simply lovely. Ooh, and some pears. <laughs> oh, if I had two more, I would have as much as I want. <clears throat> you have any uh, Marlos trees over here, guys? Oh, there's so much lag going on, though. I should do something about this. Any more Marlos, though? <laughs> uh, I'm burning it down as I search out its, like, precious, most guarded materials. Another one? What? There they are. All right. 25 Marlos berries. All right, now I can go home happy. I don't even have 25 yeast. I'll leave the rest here. They would only rot if I took them with me. And now it's time to go home. Did I say I was going to gather fruit, too? Mm, are there any groves around to check out? I already looted that apricot grove. Oh, this is the fungal area I've been terrified of since the start of the game. I've been avoiding this place. It's been steadily growing. No wonder it's so huge. Um. Oh, you know what? I think we're done. I think I'll go down to the south, see what's uh, along this edge of the woods, and head home. I should probably leave the fungus zone before I, I start going home. Phew! <clears throat> Put my spear away, enjoy a peaceful walk home, back to the campsite, where I've got a bunch of triffid bodies waiting for me. 300 pounds of triffid. Just the good parts. I would love it if I could take the uh, the stalks as well. Well, that's gonna have to be another trip. Maybe I make a note. Hel hello, who are you? Let me make sure I'm <clears throat> ready. Oh, I, did, I drank all my water. Oh, well, just have to be as ready as I am currently. 
Agility, Clarity of Blood. We'll see. Where's that character? Where are they? Southwest. Past the Chihuahua. The menacing alpha, apex predator of, of the local area. <coughs> what do you have? Serrated teeth. Interesting. Scales, long tail. Some kind of mutant. Do you have a weapon? I'm not seeing one. I'm gonna look a little closer. I don't see a weapon. I'm not seeing a holster either. I'm seeing leather pants. Emergency jacket. Messenger bag. You there. I am seeking a rare fabric. The eater of the dead. Something was ripping trees to shreds. Get out of here or I'll kill you. <laughs> um, yeah, I guess I can do that. Um, not a problem. And I was hoping I could also ask you for things. So where is it? Where is it? Where's the Eater of the Dead? Uh, uh over there. You know, I kind of wanted to explore down here anyway. Maybe I get sidetracked with, with, a, with a side quest. <coughs> oh, shit! How'd I walk right up on a f on Amigo? How'd that happen? Abracadabra. Kill it. <laughs> Shrike Stones. Sheesh. Sheesh. Hey, hang on. If attacking something isn't high enough to train your... Oh, right. <laughs> the magic spell I had. Uh, how come attacking a monster doesn't train your... Melee past level 6. What's more advanced than attacking Amigo, dude? Spear cat. Just a regular old aspect of local life, the spear cat. Better look out, they can jump on ya. Ugh. Got an infection from that. Sheesh. Oh, thing I got. So, oh, I didn't take any red potions with me. I have a Carmine Volminary. I'm gonna stop the bleeding. And probably fix it. I mean, let's be honest. Uh, if it starts looking bad, I will put the Carmine Volminary on it. Well, I don't know. Should I really let it advance like that? Weird spiders? Wow. <laughs> A lot of them. Um, you know, I can make more Carmine Vulnerary. It's not, it's not non-renewable anymore. I can just make more. And I've got the ethanol back home. Or methanol. You know what? Well, the thing is, also, a red potion would equally work. It's just that I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be home in time. Like, the infection might set in by the time I'm done with this little journey. Sorry, did I just see another purple? What's the purple? Is there a worm following me? No. <clears throat> Wandering through the fields. I've never been here, and yet there's very few dangerous things spawning. Speaking of dangerous things, here comes the threat. I think I'm going to lay runes in advance. What's this one? Carrot. Chamomile. No. All right, so we're getting very close. Make sure my speed is enhanced. So Clarity Blood does not fix infection. Healing does not fix infection. <clears throat> I think I'm going to go ahead and risk. Not risk, but play the safe route and use one of the Vulminaries. There we go. <clears throat> okay, so I'm going to put down a couple of runes uh, as close as I can. Like, once I start seeing the edge of the woods, that's where I'm going to start laying them down. Okay. Place. There. Place. There, place there, place there, place there, place there, and place there. I don't know, you think that's going to be enough? I've been using a lot of essence. 
Oh, I'm down to 200. I think I'll go ahead and make one more line. Two, three, four. All right. Now let's go find the monster. Where are you? Come, creature! Come, my foe. This holy land is not meant for your kind. Where is it? Should be close enough to hear me. I don't want to walk into the woods and get ambushed by it. Sheesh. Yell? My earplugs aren't in, right? No, my earplugs are out. Hello? I should be right up on it. It should be right over here somewhere. Hello? <clears throat> I don't want to go on the tile properly. Because, like, I don't know if I'm faster than it or not. Because I'm also... <coughs> I'm losing 50% speed from the Vulminary. Oh, there it is, Jabberwock. It is a bit faster than me. So I gotta leave immediately. I don't know if it's following or not. We will see in a moment. It is not. Also, I was at the wrong area. <laughs> okay. Well, my Lich Hook is fully loaded anyway. Yep, there it is. Can it see me? Can see me. Alright, go southeast. Let it see me then. <clears throat> Very well. If it wishes to. Let's see where it is. Is it directly northwest? No, it is not. Alright, so back this way a little bit. How close is it to... Five more tiles. This one. Four. Five. How close is it to running directly into the corner rune? Because that is what I want. It's getting closer. <clears throat> oh, now it's too far left. Shoot, I missed. It's a little hurt. Run. Okay. that goofy guy. Oh, it's not working, though. I mean, it, it hurts him a little bit, but... I mean, it's doing something. Alright, bye! <laughs> Some kind of trickster stuff going on. Oh, no. Here it comes. Um, maybe I should put down some centipedes? I don't know. I'm already tired. If I do, I'm gonna be exhausted by the time I get home. <clears throat> I still got a, quite a trek ahead of me, and I've got 300 pounds of Triffid to carry. Now, it's afternoon. Maybe it, I take a nap, but no, it needs to get home so it can be stored. Are we directly southwest? No, I need to go a tile. There. Please don't step around it. Please don't step around it. Nice. So, tile south. Nice! Oh, I'm still running out of blood essence, though. Nope. Oh, phew. Badly poisoned, sluggish, and poisoned. I don't know, does poison even work on this guy? Who knows? Slower than me now. Nice! Gonna put down one more. When it's stunned next, I'm going to reload. Oh, it it avoided it. All right, <clears throat> I'll let it get close enough to use my special ability. Oh, make sure my earplugs are in. There we go, so I don't get stunned by its howl, by its haunting noises. Abracadabra, entrap it. And 
and now we'll see if I can get it with another one. It's getting wise. Starting to realize. Shit! Should collect the runes then. Get the ammo back. Abracadabra. Oh, it's so close. I'm gonna go ahead and take out my spear, switch to Sojutsu, and see. Can I get the last couple hits? Paralyzed, partially paralyzed. No, it's partially paralyzed right now. Oh. Iridescent plate. Interesting. <clears throat> Alright, well, there's that quest. Done. And gather that. Do you think I should take this guy with me? I mean, I don't need anyone else. I'm gonna be, like, his best pal now that I've done this, so, like, maybe I can just ask him for anything cotton he has. <coughs> oh, don't stop for the black rats. Oh, my goodness. You know, it would be worth the effort to uh, figure out how to... How to add exceptions to the rules, like, just for things like chihuahuas and black rats. Like, yeah, I get it. If I walk close to a bunch of black rats, they'll attack me if I'm low on health, but I'm not that worried about rats. Or, like, oversized crows. Like, oh no, you're about to walk into this group of crows. <clears throat> I don't care. Avoid the crater, please. And there's the Chihuahua I mentioned. <laughs> All right. Greetings, traveler. Now I should have gathered my my dinosaur before I came down here. Sorry, is that Chihuahua? S sorry, sorry, is that Chihuahua trying to make an attempt on your life? Cliff, what is what is your deal? Is it? Do you think it'll... it'll kill him? It, it did damage to him. If he's not gonna fight back, theoretically, I could just hang out here and... and wait. And... Hey, Cliff. Um... <clears throat> oh, let me take out my, my earplug so I can hear his sounds of agony. I killed it. You look a little shaken up. Nope. Not really. Um. How about some items as payment? <coughs> uh, rotten cheese. Lovely. All about swords, Top Gear magazine. Um, maybe. I need your socks. I want your socks. Um. Well, I don't know. Would that be cotton? No, it's probably cotton, right? I think we'd have to find specifically wool items. No, you don't really have anything I want except that and that. Um, <clears throat> what's, uh, what's, what's, uh, how much do you value my... A thousand dollars in credit. <coughs> Jesus Christ, I could ask for anything from him. I could ask him for everything. I could leave him with no food or water. If I so desired. Alright, looks like a deal. Thanks. Thank you. B bye. No. Talking to you, Cliff. Um. <laughs> Do you want to come with me? I'll kill you if you don't. I can keep you safe. 58%. I don't know if I need more dudes, but he's a mutant. I haven't seen any mutants in a while. I want to know his story. I want to figure out... Um, can we just talk? No. Alright. Um, I can keep you safe? Yeah, I don't think so. Alright, buddy. Are you sure? Oh, wait, I gotta back off a little way. It, it, it's, it's not cheeky enough to do it while I'm there. Um, I mean, I guess I'll read these books a little bit. I mean, I didn't even need these. Sorry, All About Swords is a cutting manual? 
interesting magazine that contains information about swords. <clears throat> All right, I'll just read my religious books. You okay, buddy? How's your health looking? I mean, I could stick around here long enough for him to die, but it might take days. Dude refuses to, uh, to accept my protection as I'm watching him get gnawed to death by a chihuahua. It's a chihuahua. There are squirrels bigger than this. this uh, like, <clears throat> what would chihuahuas even eat if they were feral? What do feral chihuahuas eat? Uh, just, somebody's asked this before. What do chihuahuas eat in the wild? Mice, rabbits, insects, and small rodents. Rabbits? Holy cow. Chihuahuas? A chihuahua can kill a rabbit. They're like the size of a rabbit. Dude? I don't know. A rabbit doesn't really have much in the way of defenses, right? Like, all they can really do is run away. And I imagine the chihuahua is small enough to get into their burrows. Right? And then once they're there, th then what? What's the rabbit gonna do? Can rabbits defend themselves? <coughs> I mean, I, I imagine they can bite, but it's more of like a, a chewing sort of bite, right? It's not meant for combat. It's like a, you know, it's a support bite. I don't know. I don't know how tough rabbits can be in a fight. Uh, anyway, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.